We acknowledge the different relationships we have with Hashem. He is a shepherd, and we are his flock. He is our master, and we are his servants. He is our king, and we are his subjects. Each analogy alludes to different aspects of our relationship. When it comes to B'nai Yisrael El Sidney and begging forgiveness from Hashem, we rely on Hashem's commitment to us that we are his children and he is our father. The kind of love that a parent feels for a child is unique. It begins even before the child is born and becomes stronger as the child grows. It is unconditional. Sometimes, in order to teach a lesson, a parent must punish a child. But every parent knows how painful that is to do. Whatever hurts the child hurts the parent. And even the firmest parent can't help but have mercy. <clears throat> in Yirmiyahu, Hashem says that he can hear a friend lamenting, crying that he sins, and begging to return. Hashem responds to the cry of his child asking, Habein yakir li efraim, imelet she'ashu'im, ki midei dabribo, zechor es kirini od? Is Ephraim not my favorite son, or a delightful child, that whenever I speak of him, I remember him more and more? Alkein hamu ma'ayla. Because of this, my inner self yearns for him. Rachem ha'rachamim yonimu ma'ashem. I will have mercy on him. This is the word of Hashem. Malin explains that there are two types of love for a child. The first is for a ben yakar. This is an older child who has already achieved accomplishments and made his parents proud. The second is for a yelet sha'ashui. This is a small child who doesn't have yet have accomplishments, but who, through the sweetness of his youth, gives joy and delight to his parents. Hashem says, Ha'ben yakir li Ephraim, ar b'nei Yisrael or ben yakar? They have delved into my Torah, they built a Mishkan and a Beit HaMikdash, and have served me with devotion. Is there any question that they have made me proud and that they are dear to me? In Yelet Sha'ashuim? B'nai Yisrael adhere to their belief in me, even in their earliest days in Yisrael. They followed me into the desert and said, Na'asev and Ishma, even without knowing what I would ask. Is there any question that their unconditional love for me gave me delight and joy? It is because of this that whenever I speak of B'nai Israel, I remember my pride and my delight and my joy. Even though they have sinned, and even though they deserve to be punished, I cannot help myself from responding to their plea. They are my beloved children, and I will have mercy on them. Tonight, we begin to be float, and every day through Yom Kippur, we will beg Hashem for forgiveness. Please, Hashem, we have sinned and we want to return to you. Remember how you cherished us and how you yearned for us. You will always be our father, and we will always be your beloved children. 